up and yo, welcome back to another YouTube video and today we're taking a look at another news video and this news video is about tubs and numbskulls. They are back at it again with a new innovative product. They have kept their tubs going um, and they've now done mini tubs and they're now doing tub plushes. So they are definitely following in the footsteps of Funko and U2s by making plushes and figures. Uh, but they're duckifying characters. That is their whole sort of brand. So we have Funko Pops making them into Funkos. And then we have U2s making them into U2s where they have their own unique design. Where they're the character but their eyes are sort of different. Where Funkos they have a bigger head and they have circular black eyes, no nose, no mouth. Whereas U2s they're quite comic-y, quite cartoony with the sort of circular eyes. But they're sort of like crescent moons on the side, they look pretty happy and smiley eyes, but now we have tubs where they're turning characters into ducks, and they have made teddies and plushes for these guys, and the starting wave looks pretty solid, we have Santa, we have a couple of Destiny characters, we have Cade 6 here, which is really cool, and one that I really want to get because I do love Cade 6, and I think he looks adorable as a duck. These plushes are quite big, they're a lot bigger than normal tubs, and I don't think they have a tub to come in, but there is so many cool characters here, which I didn't really expect to see as a plush here. But they are also releasing a new Mortal Kombat wave uh, to sort of coincide with the new movie. There is four new uh, tubs with Sub-Zero, um, Scorpion, Caden, I do believe he's called, and another one which I'm not too familiar with. He's got four arms and he looks pretty evil there with his top knot. He isn't one that I would get. He's just another Mortal Kombat character, which I see in the roster, I see in the story but I don't pay too much attention to him. I don't really like this character. He was in the Mortal Kombat movie, but I do believe he was killed quite quickly. I don't think they focus too much of him on the live-action Mortal Kombat movie. Here is Caden. He is a lightning martial artist who I do believe is blind. However, I could be wrong. His outfit looks really cool, and I like the lightning going up above his head. He looks pretty confident and cocky. He also looks like he's having a good time, and lightning... Uh, is one of my favourite powers, and my other favourite elemental powers is fire, and having them together would be insane, but here is Scorpion, throwing his kunai, about to do the get over here, his iconic line from Mortal Kombat, the get over here, oh, which is really cool, I like how they have their masks on as well, it is the OG Mortal Kombat design, with the sort of black and uh, other colour outfits, because they have the blues and the greens and the yellows and oranges for the, each different character here, and here is Sub-Zero doing a fatality, pulling out someone's spine, and that little skull there is obviously a duck skull, and it looks so adorable. I don't know why, it doesn't look menacing at all, it looks quite cute, and it looks like a duck dressed up as Sub-Zero for Halloween, and I'm really excited for this wave. I'm not going to get any, because they are quite expensive, I do believe they're 25 to £30 each, but other than that, I hope you enjoyed, see you on the next one, have a nice day, and goodbye.